Well, in 1950, my mother and father, Earl and Rita Willems, came and uh, bought the Sister Bay Hotel. They took the dance hall in 1958 and turned it into the bowling alley. So in 1958, the Sister Bay Bowl was born. In 1964, they took the residence, which was uh, our living quarters, which is now the Sister Bay Bowl's dining room. And we started serving food in 1964, and we're in our 49th summer. It's a family-run business, has been all these years. Uh, my mother is still alive and helps uh, in a small way here and there, but all the, myself and my siblings are all still here working full-time, have, have all our lives. Well, I think people thought he was crazy in, in the mid-50s that even thought of it. But he just, there was not much going on in mid-1950 in Sister Bay. And my dad thought he would try putting a six-lane bowling alley. And it turned out to be unbelievably successful. Leagues were over the top. Two leagues every night, Monday through Friday night. Um, and they were very popular. And it was a sport to watch. They would fill the bowling alley with people just coming to be spectators and watch the bowling. Well, over the years, that has really changed. Bowling isn't quite so popular. But it, it did start as a bowling alley, and hence the name, Sister Bay Bowl and Supper Club. The bowling was first. The food that you find at the Sister Bay Bowl is a combination of great steaks, our fresh lake perch, and locally caught whitefish ribs, and uh, a variety of combination plates, uh, pastas, you name it, we pretty much got it. Nice little kids menu. Just anything, you know, from sandwiches to a great steak. The Sister Bay Bowl is a classic supper club. Great food, great cocktails. We also happen to have a six lane bowling alley, which people consider us a bowling alley. In reality, I would say we're a classic supper club that serves great food, catered to kids, and you get a large amount of food for a good price. Well, it's a, it's a new time, it's a new uh, generation. We still have our like our generational families that have been coming for these years and we're trying to get the newer, younger generation. And a lot of the feedback I, I'll get is the food is just unbelievable. But the, the, the decorations, the decor, not, it's a little vintage as our vintage bowling alley. And, and um, but that's the way we, we like it and we'll probably keep it. But maybe this next generation that takes over the Sister Bay Bowl, they'll be making some changes. And that'll be good. That'll be good.